We can't have a totally armed society. In February, you introduced the Assault Weapons Ban and Law Enforcement Protection Act of 2007. It would regulate semi-automatic assault weapons, including weapons that have pistol grips, a forward grip, and something called a barrel shroud. But what's a barrel shroud, and why should we regulate that? The guns that were chosen back in, uh, in those days were basically the guns that most gangs and criminals were using to kill our, our police okay. officers. I'm not saying it was the best bill, but that okay. was the best do, bill do that could get out at that particular is? time. I actually don't know what a barrel oh, shot okay, I it's, in your it's a shoulder thing that goes up. Big clips, a hundred plus bullets in each, large velocity guns. This is a ghost gun. This right here has ability with a 30 caliber clip to disperse with 30 bullets within half a second. 30 magazine clip in half a second. What's the efficacy of, pa of banning these magazine clips? I will tell you, these, these, this is, these are um, ammunition. They're bullets. So the people who have those now, they're going to shoot them. And so if you ban, if you ban them in the future, the number of these high-capacity magazines is going to decrease dramatically over time because the bullets will have been shot and there won't be any more available. <laughs> Isn't it pretty hard to define what is an assault weapon because it's so easy to write around for manufacturers to create weapons that... Well, if it can fire a lot of bullets very quickly, that's a good, definite, good place to start. <laughs> there are bullet pier armor-piercing bullets. <laughs> Let's say three. If you haven't hit the deer with three shots, you're a pretty lousy shot. <laughs> But that would ban most pistols. That would ban most... No, but pistols are different. You have to pull the trigger each time. An assault weapon, you basically hold it, goes... Blah, blah, blah. No, those are fully automatic weapons. Okay. <laughs> you still have to pull a trigger, but if it's 30 bullets or 20 bullets or 10 bullets before you run out, I would suggest the deer is... God wants that deer to live. <laughs> but according to gun owners, what you've just described would ban most guns that hunters use today. If that's what they're using, for God's sakes, why don't they use dynamite? <laughs> this does not prohibit, you use the word prohibit, it exempts 2,271 weapons. Isn't Mr. that enough for the people in the United States? M Mr. Do Chairman. they need a bazooka? <laughs> The position that a lot of people are going to say is, all you're going to accomplish is taking guns away from the good people and the bad people are still going to... No, 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 that's not true. Now, that's easy to say for a man who has 24-hour police protection. When I come in to interview you, i got to go through metal detectors, there are men with guns out there, and oh, no. make sure that you're safe. Okay? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> In the spirit of gun control, will you disarm your entire security team? Uh, no. You will think, get right back to you. You'll get Came back over to me? very friendly. Would you like a sip of my Very soda? friendly body language. They're Grab grabbing on him. Why? Grabbing why? on him, dragging him why away. Why can you defend yourself but not Pushing him back. the majority yeah. of Americans? I mean, look at, look at the team of security you got. And you're an advocate for gun control? One, two, three, four, five. Five. I'm counting. There are probably more. We need to do this every day of the week and just really brainwash people into thinking about guns in a vastly different way. It's not about keeping guns out of the hands of law-abiding Americans. And I'm sick and tired of people lying to the American people. We're not, we're not proposing a gun registration system. We're proposing background checks for criminals. No one's taking away all the guns. We will be able to be armed. We yes, will sir. take all yes, weapons. Sir. I'd love to see that. <laughs> in uniform. <laughs> You've heard it here. I'm on television, so everybody knows it. I believe in the Second Amendment. I believe in people's lawful right to bear arms. <laughs> I will not take your shotgun away. 
I will not take your life away. I won't take your head away. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. America, turn them all in. Look at that.